Hi, this is Joe with the Unsend All team. I'm going to show you the new features in our newest version of Unsend All. When you open the application, you'll agree with the instruction team. This is going to walk you through logging into Instagram and the methodology behind unsending all of your chats one by one or together in the premium tier. You're also going to have a list of common errors to work through if, you're, if you have any problems using the application. The bread and butter of the application happens in the chat view. When you open it up, you're going to see that there's no sync chats, so you're going to need to press the sync chats button to sync in your chats. As you can see, the chats that are on now on the left hand side in your Instagram view have been synced into the application. When we sync your chats, we don't actually store any message text or any image data or anything like that. All we store are the chat names, the chat IDs, the message IDs, and then also the message types. Just if the message is text or media, so then when we use the media option only option, we're able to switch between both of them. I'm going to go through the premium features first. This is a premium installation here. So I have these all and selected features and buttons that you see down here. And I also have the ability to select chats on the left hand side. If you only pay for the individual membership, you won't see these features. We'll be reviewing the individual features later on in the video if you'd like to jump ahead. So let's say you're coming in and you simply want to unsend all of your messages. The sync and unsend all messages button will help you achieve this. This syncs all your messages, so it loads all the message IDs into unsend all, and it begins to unsend them, which you can see on the left hand side. Now let's say there's some sort of interruption, or maybe you just want to cancel unsending and come back to it later because you don't want to keep your computer on all day, what have you. You can press the unsend all synced messages button to continue where you left off. So as you can see, I originally had 22 messages in your apps. Now I'm down to 20 messages. And when I press unsend all synced messages, you're going to see that the, mess the new messages are not synced into the application and immediately begins unsending. As you can see, it's begun unsending and it's already gotten rid of two messages. Now let's say you only want to unsend messages and select the chats. With these buttons on the left hand side, you're able to select the chats which you want to unsend messages from. And these buttons work similarly to the ones in the All section, except they're scoped only to your selected messages. If you press Sync and Unsend Selected Messages, it's going to resync your messages and then begin unsending them. As you can see, it resynced Instagram and Instagram for Business, which are the only two that were selected, your apps was not selected, and it began to unsend them. And the same deal with the Unsend Selected Sync Messages button. It's going to begin unsending immediately without syncing first. It's going to work off the list you've already synced. This feature is useful in very long chats that can be 10,000, 15,000, 20,000 messages, where it can take maybe 20 or 30 minutes to sync all of your messages. So in chats like that, you'll save a lot of time being able to just unsend the selected sync messages as opposed to having to sync each individual time that you want to unsend messages. Now not everybody wants to unsend all their text message content. A lot of people like to just unsend media only. Maybe they have pictures or videos which they no longer want to share. If you want to unsend only media, you press the unsend media only button, and then you'll see that immediately the synced message count list is cut down. There's 19 messages in your apps generally, but there's only two media messages. And as you can see, it's these two image messages here. When I press the unsend all synced media messages button, it's going to begin to unsend all of the messages in all my chats, which in this case is just your apps. This feature also works with a selected message or even to sync and unsend all media messages. But I'll use it with this unsend all sync media messages now. I'll press it and as you can see the first photo was unsent and now the second photo is going to be unsent in a second here. As you can see there's a short delay between unsending messages. This is due to Instagram's limits which we need to work within. Once you're done with all your synced message data, you can press the red trash can icon. That's going to delete this chat name, the underlying chat ID, the message IDs which have been stored in your local computer, and also the message type, which is going to be the media or text indicator. As you can see, all the synced chat data has been deleted. Now I'll show you what the application looks like when you're not in premium mode. When you're in individual mode, you're not going to have this all section, you're not going to have the selected section, and you're not going to have these individual selectors for selecting all the messages or selecting individual messages on the left hand side. You're only going to see this tabular view 
with the unsend all sync messages and unsend synced button and you're only going to be able to interact with it line by line. So if you want to unsend all the messages in your apps, for example, you can press the unsend all button. This syncs all the messages first and then begins to unsend them. If you'd simply like to sync messages in an individual chat, you can press the sync messages button. It'll sync all the messages that are in there. And then you can unsend them separately with the unsend synced button. There was only one message in there, so that's why it unsent it so quickly. And now you're back to normal. And again, if I'm to press the unsend synced message button here, you'll see that it begins just simply unsending the synced messages in one individual chat. And just like premium, when you're finished with the chat data, just press the delete button and it's all removed from your local computer. Again, no text data, no image data, no video data or anything like that is even stored to your local computer and the developers cannot access any of your data at any time. Thank you for watching this demo. I hope that you consider Unsend All for all your mass unsending needs. You can get more information and purchase a product at www.unsendall.com. If you have any questions, you can contact the developers at support at unsendall.com. We typically respond within a day. Thanks a lot. I hope you consider us in the future and happy unsending.